In South Central Los Angeles, young men of color are exposed to gangs and crimes, but less than 1% of these schools offer computer science education. We needed to come up with a solution that's gonna give them a path, not just out of poverty, but make sure that they don't end up in jail. TXT, Teens Exploring Technology. It's a program that uses technology as a tool to empower young black and Latino boys to become catalysts of change in urban communities. Throughout the year, we're serving about 500 kids who are the ages of 12 to 17 years old. And the average income of the families in those communities is about $20,000 a year. The next stop is 103rd Street. I live in Watts, and my mom and my dad are both immigrants. My mom worked as a house cleaner. My dad, he does construction. If I had not come to TXT, I wouldn't be able to have the hope of joining a technology company. The first day that I walked into TXT, I didn't speak at all. But throughout the program, Oscar has been challenging me to speak up more and more. And that has really helped me a lot in my self-confidence and my voice. The Q is the first hacker space in South Central Los Angeles. You will find kids that are creating drones, they're creating apps. It's become a community of innovators and a second home for a lot of these boys. Our Summer Coding Leadership Academy is a 12-week program of learning how to solve community problems. They get trained to do coding, design, and also how to pitch to investors. Once I understood the API, we developed it really quickly. Hey, Doug, I'm entering. Welcome, Oscar Menjiver. You recognize my voice now? Yeah. Good job. Can we give him a round? 100% of the young boys that go through their program, they're graduating high school. They are not uh, just learning how to code. They're, they're learning how to be leaders, how to articulate opinions and problems and solutions to those problems. If you ever get thrown in a problem, you can know yourself and know what you're good at to overcome that problem. What I've learned through the sales program. You can imagine a future where they become decision makers at companies later on in their career that can have really positive impacts. Hustle and Code is a hackathon that happens in the housing projects. We said to ourselves, why not bring professionals and technology companies over to the poorest communities in Los Angeles so the kids can see who they can become? I remember going to Silicon Valley and seeing lots of companies that were predominantly white and I saw it as an opportunity for me to change the workspace and make it more diverse. These big tech companies are in big demand of JavaScript programmers and I am one of them. What I'm excited about is that the kids are not just learning how to code, what they're learning is how to think bigger, what they're learning is how to think about the impossible and be the creators of their own future.